This mural off of Siegel Avenue was part of a Belmont neighborhood project, and the artist behind it says it took two years to finish. So when someone vandalized it over the weekend, she was disappointed. It's not always obvious, but once you start looking for it, it's everywhere. I thought it would be like a good message because that's what they wanted. History and a good message. Art has inspired Rosalia Torres Weiner for all of her life. She's been painting colorful, beautiful murals all over Charlotte for the last decade. Of course I was disappointed. You know, I have been doing this for more than 10 years. For the first time ever, one of her murals was vandalized. The first thing that I asked them is that, um, do you know what they use? Because, you know, it depends on what you, they use. Then you have to use, you know, different products. Someone had taken a permanent marker to her mural in the Belmont neighborhood and painstakingly wrote curse word after curse word, phrase after phrase, all over the painting. People don't know that it's just paint and uh, we can fix it, we can paint again. Rosalia creating a new mural with just a tiny bit of the vandalism left behind. Like faces, I still want to paint faces and call it the voices of our community. So I started with the first one with my mom. There's a reason why art is everywhere. Guy with a Sharpie, <laughs> that is, that, that's not going to stop me at all. It has a way of adapting and existing no matter what. Rosalia says it took volunteers only two hours to paint over everything. So she says that's just more proof that there are more good people than bad. In the Belmont neighborhood, Maureen Wirtz, Fox 46.